Hi y'all, this is Tam. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be doing a flip through for you guys. And this is a magazine called Calm, C-A-L-M, as you can see there. This is my very first time purchasing this magazine and I got it from Barnes & Noble. And as with most of my magazines, um, <clears throat> they are not printed or um, what do you call it? published in the United States, I find that I am more prone to buy magazines from other countries. They just appeal to me. <clears throat> Excuse me. But um, I can't even remember where this one is from. But look, um, I'll try to find out and put it in the description of this video. But if I forget to do that, oh, here it is, printed in the UK. So that's where this book is from. So I'm going to be doing a flip through <clears throat> of it for you guys on today. And the thing that made me purchase this book is because it said creativity, paper art, meditation, nature, and ritual at the top. And they had me at creativity. So any magazine that um, gets my creativity sparked, I like because... I just like being able to create in especially using things made out of paper so this is what the outside of it looks like and it says project calm mindfulness through making <clears throat> and this is trying to see what issue this is there's usually it just says calm number 10 the 2008 uh, calm number 10 issue 2008 so we'll go ahead and flip through <clears throat> this is what it looks like on the inside cover and this of course breaks down everything that's going to be talked about on the inside look at this image I mean I don't even know what to say isn't that beautiful it's, it's stuff like that that makes me not even think about the price I'm not going to even lie <clears throat> excuse me I seem to be trying to come down with something. My husband is sick and um, he has tried to give me his sickness, <laughs> if that makes sense. He wants to kiss, he wants to hug and all that. And I'm like, baby, you are sick. I don't want your germs. That doesn't mean anything to him. He still tries to give me his germs. So I will not be surprised if in a couple of days, I am sick sick I mean like coughing and because I have the sniffles right now <clears throat> and um, I feel my throat trying to have something going on with it as well a bird does not sing because he has an answer he sings because he has a song I love these images try to keep my hand out the way <laughs> so you guys can see <clears throat> and again um, most of these magazines are made out of real paper I mean like not that shiny glossy regular magazine paper so you will definitely be able to um, use these and not get that glare <clears throat> and again I use these as journaling prompts and I use them in my regular journaling and I'm not literal so I don't mind putting an owl down on the page and what I'm writing about has absolutely nothing to do with an owl. I know that bothers some people. It has to match. You can cut this out and make this little box here you see on the side. But it doesn't have to match for me. So um, that's just the way my mind works. Some things have to match, some things don't. And when I'm journaling, nothing has to match. I'm more concerned about what it is I am putting down on the page. <clears throat> this is your brain on depression finding your path to getting better you guys may um, see a couple of videos ago or I don't even know how many videos ago by the time this magazine flip through gets up but I journaled about depression in my teenage son and how um, we're getting him treatment but a part of his depression does stem from anxiety and um, self-esteem so um, depression is a real thing guys and if you had asked me 14 years ago when he was born if I thought he was going to be a depressed child I would have said no I don't think nobody 
thinks it's going to be them, but we have no say over what happens to us and when it happens. And definitely we have no control over other people. So, um, you can't stop bad things from happening to yourself or your loved ones. When it happens, you just um, pray, um, figure out what it is God will have for you to do and move forward. <clears throat> So I love this magazine. I love, you know, the um, title pages and different things like that. I definitely, lo definitely love the vibrancy of the pictures and like this, these paper pieces you can use in your journaling. <clears throat> How to um, make your inbox a happier place. <laughs> I just, because I have a desk job, I hate checking emails at work and talking on the phone at work. So when I get home, those are the last things I want to do. I, I sometimes forget to check my email regarding my uh, social media accounts and <clears throat> my cell phone and my home phone rings and we walk by it and don't even answer it. I know that's probably bad, especially if someone has an emergency. And I can really count on one hand how many times a call has been a true emergency in my family versus either they're calling about something that's not important. And sometimes people will literally blow your phone up, like calling every five minutes. And you're like, what is going on? And they'll, they'll say something like, Oh, um, you remember that time? And it'll be something totally random. And it's like, were you really calling me five times back to back to ask about something that happened 20 years ago to see if I remember? And it's usually like um, they're arguing about something and they're trying to get a witness to agree with them. And it's, you know, it ends with, I told you, I told you, I told you. <laughs> Does that happen to anybody else? Put your feet up. So this is talking about tea and, and you know, the um, the benefits of drinking tea. I like drinking tea, natural um, tea, uh, decaf tea. But um, I have like my staples. Usually I don't try a whole lot of different things because some teas have just really turned me off. But I do have like my staple teas that um, I usually keep on hand here at the house. And this is the last page. Until next time. And that's the back. And that's the front. Love these magazines. I appreciate you guys for stopping by. If you're not a subscriber to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell so you can know when I upload new videos. If you don't know, I have a second channel. It's linked below. It's a Bible journaling channel. I invite you to come join me over there. I Bible journal in my journaling Bible as well as talk about my faith. So I appreciate you guys. Thanks for stopping by and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Bye.